Welcome back, everybody, to some more Octopath Traveler. I'm your host, the Musical Gamer. We're still here in the Lizardman Den. We finished the boss, and we're about to go find Earhart. Hello there, Earhart. <laughs> Boy, you got some splaining to do. You slew yours too, I see. Aye. Without the leaders, the pack should soon descend into chaos and confusion. It will be easy enough to chase them off at our leisure. Good. So, uh, mind explaining what you're doing here, buddy? After, you know, murdering my legion lord? So, Ulrich, how did you find me? Oh, let me tell you, it was not easy. Gustav told me. Ha, that's so. How was the scoundrel? Still in one piece? He was well. Fighting for his keep. He told me about Grind, your hometown. Mm, yeah, that he did. Sounds like you had a grand old chat. Did he tell you about the soldiers who burned it to the ground? Tough world, this, for a young lad without a home. When the band of cell sorts picked me up, I was grateful for it. And when the boss told me he wanted my help to bring down Hornberg, well, suffice to say he didn't to ask twice you wanted revenge clearly I against the king who did not as the only home I'd ever known was reduced to ash and rubble even at the end as the flames licked the roof beams of their homes my family my friends believed the king would save them ah dude I swore then and there I would never forgive King Alfred that he'd pay for what he'd done. <laughs> You're not done, as it were. Well, let me ask you this then. Was it worth it? And so I came to Hornburg and became a knight. Served my commanders faithfully. Worked my way up in the ranks. But then, you know that story, don't you? All the while, biding your time to that final battle. Delivered my revenge at the point of my blade, even as the king looked into my eyes. Damn. His majesty was a courageous man. <laughs> Clearly facing down his own death. <laughs> Ooh, ye, can you even imagine that? He was that. Till the last, he never stopped fighting for his people. And I... A single blow, I. I killed him in the name of vengeance. Spilt his blood on the soil of his realm. I thought it would set me free. Free from the anguish, the pain, the despair. Well, let me guess. It, uh, it only made things worse, huh? But it gave me nothing. No release, no triumph. Only a hollowness. A cold, empty void where my rage once burned. As I searched for something to hold on to, the memories that came to me were not of my lost home, but of the years I'd spent as a knight, with my brothers in arms, with you. Did you regret it? That's the question of the hour. Regret it? Aye, I certainly did. I regretted living a lie for all those years in the name of vengeance. And yet, though they were a lie, ah, a strange thing, isn't it? The memories of those days are as real as anything I have. The days of you working your way up through the ranks, I imagine? Those days in Hornburg. The barracks, the proving grounds, the jousting lists. But anyhow, we disbanded after that and went our separate ways. We'd accomplished our aim, but were left homeless, masterless. My wanderings brought me to Wellspring, a town like a hundred others I'd seen before. And yet you stayed, and now protect its people from harm. You know, that is so funny how... <laughs> Ulbrich and Earhart are on two opposing sides of this issue. 
they, they are literally a good representation of the flip side of the coin. One is heads, one is tails. But they both ended up in the same sort of place. Earhart here in Wellspring and Ulbrich in Cobbleston. And ironically, only a stone's throw from each other. That is really, really weird. It's kind of funny how that works. But I guess it just goes to show that they're really similar people when it comes down to it. Aye. Uh, what? I, game? What are you, what are you doing? Why, why are you making me, why, why are you making me do this? I don't, he, he's level 10! He's strength 10! I don't want to do this! Don't make me do this! Oh no, can I, can I back, I can't back out. Oh. Okay then, Earhart, old buddy, old pal, old traitorous scumbag, sir, it is time to do it, do it, do it, do it. Oh fuck me! Draw your blade, Earhart. Oh God, why? You don't have to do this, Ulbrich. Yeah, listen to him. We really don't. I can end it for you. All of it. Your anger, your pain, your regret. This lie your life has become. I'll cut you down and give you the peace you seek. My king dead, and my countrymen. What did that make me who had sworn my very life to protect them? For what did I wield my sword? Gods. How many years did that question plague me? But at long last, I understood. I never lost my worth. Like you, I bear my sword so that I may protect others. Earhart, I cannot stand here and pretend to understand what caused you to do as you did. And though I search my heart, I find no room there I find only I should have bested you that day. Victory should have been mine. Then, and only then, could I have saved our liege. And you, from the monster you would become. Jesus Christ, this scene. Holy crap. With the music and the, and, and the words and the... Oh, man. Hear me, Earhart. This time... I will not lose. Draw your weapon, Earhart. For warriors such as us, there is no other way. Dude, you, you're making me want to fight him. I just wanted to turn tail and run five minutes ago. <sighs> I could tell you to learn from my mistakes. But then, what right have I? Nay, we'll do it your way. No holding back, eh, hey, old friend? I would not have it any other way. So be it. Oh, crap. In victory, truth! I will not Oh, fail. god damn. Oh my god, look, no look at this shit. The music is still playing, and we're fighting him. He's 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 enormous uh, again. Again, um, but it's one on one, mano a mano. God, oh Jesus Christ! I'm getting shivers. Oh, this is this is not good. Okay, what do we do here? What is he weak to? Swords? He is weak to swords. Okay, fair enough. Ow, this is fine. We're gonna we're gonna. I I think what I'm gonna do here, we're gonna build our. BP, obviously, and we're gonna we're actually gonna go do I think stout wall relatively early on. Once I can get one more BP point, no, good, there we go. Um, stout wall gives us nine turns of defense. Ah, yes, we are well well defended now at this point. Oh, Jesus Christ, he still does tons of damage. 
Keep it up, Ulbrich. You can do this, man. You can freaking do this. Oh my god, I'm getting, I'm getting pumped up. This is, this is not how I envisioned my day going. Dear God. Um. Okay. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go before him this turn. The battle is truly joined. That is what I wanted to see. All right, break him. Let's get a super powerful cross strike going. I think we could um, afford to take two hits at least. We're gonna have to use a healing item after that, but... Watch my play dance. Nice, 3200 damage. I didn't have bad, though. <laughs> Damn. I'm actually wondering, maybe maybe I should just forget the... Um, maybe I should just forget the defense boosting yeah. stuff here. Ow! And just go for full-on offense, because the defense boost is not really actually blocking much damage. I mean, it's blocking about 100, I think, on average, ultimately, from each attack. So, yeah, maybe, maybe it is being worth it. I'm not sure. Victory shall be won. Then again, we could just be doing more damage to him overall, and, like, a lot more damage to him overall. So, I don't know. Hmm. Let's hit him one more time. Smacked in the face. Yeah, it's the, it is blocking about like 100 damage or so. It is it is adding up over time. But you know what? We'll do we'll do this abide. And now we'll stout wall. We'll get both going here. Dear God, dude. Um, I need to heal. <laughs> I really need to heal. Yet again. Fine. That wastes a turn of all my buffs. At least we got them for multiple turns here. All right, let's keep building our BP again. So we can do another super powerful cross strike as soon as we're able to. Oh, good timing. Very good timing. The battle is truly Ooh, look at that. 4,700 damage. That is good. That's a good hit. Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What the hell was that? Blazing stance improved. Excuse me? What did you just do, dude? Ooh, he's red. Victory shall be Ow! Oh my god, that did a lot of damage. Uh, ha, ha. Oh, what the hell? Uh, dude, what did you just do? Oh, you just sealed my boost. Oh, crap. About this? Fine. No, I, I need to use healing items here. At least this one-on-one -on -one combat is relatively simple, for the most part. Ow! Oh god, now he's, he's just boost-locking me. Great. Lovely. Are you... Are you really doing this again? Oh my god, nope. I'm just gonna have to keep slashing at you. <laughs> Forget this. I ain't gonna get anywhere. Um... Yep, no, I can't use anything. Nothing, nada. Yeah, he's just gonna keep doing this over and over again, isn't he? No matter what I do. Um, I suppose what I can do here is actually use Silence, Blindness, Confusion. What 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 is this? Is this um the terror state? Well, actually, if if it's anything, it's probably terror. How about this? Aha, this is terror. Okay. Fair enough. No! I <laughs> still don't know. I still don't know like all of the um all of the different status ailments, <laughs> which is kind of funny. I I don't know what they all look like. This game doesn't really explain it to you. You just sort of figure it out as you go. Now, we could... Eh, he's gonna... I knew it. I knew he was gonna do that. Son of a bit. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh! oh. Ah. Uh.
Oops. Now hold the phone. Isn't this a... Uh, oh god, I have to fight that lizard boss again, don't I? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Victory shall be mine. Okay, we're back. Welcome back to the fight. I... <laughs> Jesus Christ. We're gonna do this again, and we're gonna we're gonna win this time. We're gonna kick Earhart's ass to the curb, and he is not going to do the same to me, because I've learned all of his dirty little tricks in the meantime. I think I've seen pretty much everything he can do. Now we could just break him now. Which honestly doesn't seem like a bad idea. Though I am wondering, actually, uh, if maybe we should spend some oh, no. No, 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 please. Oh, damn it. It's only two turns. No! It, will he do it again is the question. I mean, we can break him this turn, which is kind of funny. Um, let's just not. defend. Okay. Not too bad. That got us an extra BP point, too. Now, we could just break him. Yeah, honestly, you know what? I don't even think the abide's worth it. The bide is not worth it, because he's just going to use that stupid move again on me and cause me not to be able to use my BP, which is worse than not... Worse than not having a physical enhancement. Aha! See? Because we got him. <laughs> we got him with that one hit. See? Totally done on the first try. Shut up. What do you mean it wasn't done on the first try? You didn't, you didn't see anything. It was totally done in the first go. I... I yield. It is a strange thing. Though I fought with all my strength, it was as if you were protected by a greater power. Oh, really? You think so, huh? And yet, for the first time in as long as I can remember, I regret nothing. I... How do you feel, Ulbrich? Do you count this as your revenge? I mean, you beat him, but you didn't kill him. I thought your goal was to actually, like, end his life. So, where do we go from here? Are the boys getting back Tell together? Me one thing, Herhart. Who was he? The leader of your little band. The man who plotted Hornberg's fall. Oh, well, wait a minute. Hold the hold the phone. That's a good point. You know, despite Earhart being the one who actually killed the king, he wasn't the one who orchestrated this, was he? I actually forgot about Ulrich. that. Ulrich, leave it be. He brought down an entire kingdom. Our kingdom. Who knows what such a man is plotting now? Nay. Such a fiend is too dangerous for this world. I will stop him. I must. This is the cause you found. Just so. Well, it's better than just the revenge against my friend. Is Verna. Werner. Where can I find him? Hmm. Sounds diabolical enough. It's German. It works. After the fall of Hornberg, he set off for Riverford. After that, the gods only know what became of him. That's all I need to know. Men like that leave a trail, whether they mean to or not. You know what, Ulbrich? If the whole revenge thing doesn't work out for you, you'd make a pretty kick-ass P.I. Just gonna say. <laughs> Reckon they do. Until someone stops them in their tracks. Oh, hey guys. You're alive! And Lord Earhart. See for yourself. We worked out our problems. We're good now. Wow. Well, Took some dinner, I don't know about good. But we slew the leaders of the horde. Once your men finish off the stragglers. You'll have nothing more to fear from that nest. Did you hear that, lads? Earhart slew their leaders! Couldn't have done it had Obrick not shown up in the nick of time. The 
two greatest knights of a lost realm fighting side by side. Bang me if it ain't like a storybook. You have our undying gratitude, Sir Oberic. I do not warrant it. What I did was for myself. And now the time has come for me to seek out a new cause in another place. Oberic, I... You would remain here. Yes, you should stick around, protect this place. I'm sorry. It's your duty now. No need to apologize. Do not be. But before you go, let me say one more thing. If you mean to go up against Verna, watch your back. Oh? How so? I've never seen anyone swing a blade like he does. It's more than just strength and skill. There's something about him that strikes fear into men's hearts. Well, you've never seen me navigate a combat menu before, either before now, Earhart, so, uh, I think I got this. You are stronger now, Ulbrich. Stronger than me, I dare say. If your will is strong, you are doubtless the measure of him. But make no mistake, you would be well advised to fear him. Coming from you, Earhart. That is warning indeed. I will heed your words. And now I must go. When this is over, mayhap we shall meet again. Under better circumstances, I hope. I look forward to that day, old friend. That you shall. And so did Ulbrich leave Wellspring behind him. For too long he had forgotten a simple truth. He wields his sword to protect the people, and that means he cannot let the mortal foe of Hornburg roam free. And so he set off for Riverford, where his long journey may at last come to an end. So that is our next goal. Well, for Ulbrick at least, our next goal is to go to uh, Riverford. Hello there, Travel Bender, who is it? Hey, Tressa! <laughs> <laughs> you look pleased. I'm happy that you and Earhart made up. Now you're comrades in arms again. It was a long road to reach such a point. But fighters are straightforward men, and they understand each other. Crossing swords just once can tell me more about another than a thousand words. Wow, that sounds incredible. If you're interested in my world, I could teach you a little fencing. Really? I'd love to be your apprentice. I'll be the best pupil you ever had, Sir Ulbrich. I promise you won't regret this. I may already. <laughs> I, I may regret bringing this up in just a minute. Let's see if you know your way. Let's see if you know the pointy end of the stick. To the blunt end of the stick. Oh God, Ulbrich, I don't, I don't know, man. You, you might have, you might have made a grave mistake in thinking you could trust Tressa. <laughs> you might have made a horrible, horrible mistake. Oh, jeez. All right, then. Well, um, that is actually going to be all for this episode. I know it's a little bit on the shorter side, probably, because I got that whole bit to cut out in the middle. But when we come back with some more Octopath Traveler, we will, um, do we do... I might actually spend some time level grinding a little, uh, going back to those caves, fighting some things, getting everybody to maybe the mid-30s or so. Of course, that means Tress is just going to get even more powerful. Oh, she's already so overpowered as is. Um, but that is just kind of something I'm keeping in mind. Where is... Right, Tressa needs to go over here. What level does she need to be? Recommend a level 45. I mean, she's level 40 now. So, I mean... I think what we'll do... I'll spend some time level grinding some people. Um, and then when Tressa gets to level 45, I think we're going to do her chapter 4 just right then and there. I, I don't think we're gonna, even if it, it breaks the flow of all these chapter threes, I, I think I gotta do it, because otherwise, she's just getting too powerful. And uh, I kinda wanna have her out of my party for a little while, but you know, that's just something for me to think about for the future. Anyway, that is all for me. Thanks all for watching. If you enjoyed, be sure to let me know down below, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. See you guys next time.